Hello YouTube, greetings from the Republic of Texas. New house, new problems. No pool this time, but today I'm gonna to show you how to find the cable uh, outlets and the proper terminations in your attic uh, so that you can hook up your cable, antenna, internet, whatever you're doing. This is what the construction company left us with, so this big mess, nothing labeled. Uh, I'm gonna show you today how I'm tracing down the outlets inside the house and the correct wire up in the end. So here are the things I'm gonna be using, some simple things. This is a multimeter. You gotta have the continuity setting on there so that when you uh, go up and trace, you can hear audibly that you've got a, a completed circuit. Uh, just some simple, something to cut your wire with so you can get one of these. This is a piece of coax that I'm gonna show you what to do with in just a second. Some labels, some tape, and something to use to, to trim and splice, and, or not splice, but to uh, strip the wire and, and all that. And then of course a marker and we'll get into the next part of the video. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our small piece of coax and we're gonna strip the outer covering, the shield, the inner covering, and we're gonna try to get the center wire out of this piece of coax. And that is, where is that? That's that kind of shiny piece right there in the center. That's the guy we're looking for right there is that piece of wire that is the center wire out of your piece of coax. I'm gonna show you what to do with that right now. So that you uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our wire and we're gonna stick it right in the center and make sure it kind of goes in there a good, good amount. And then we're basically gonna wrap this around the outside to connect the inner wire to the outer wire to complete the circuit for testing. And let me do that and I'll show you what it kind of looks like. It's not pretty, but it's the center wire connected to the outer uh, part to make the circuit for testing. Um, and you can reuse that for another one later on if you want to. So let's get up in the attic and see if we can figure out where this wire Okay, is. here we are up in the attic. And what we're gonna do is all we gotta do is, we, this is just our first wire we're gonna test. We're gonna touch one of the leads to the outer, or the inner wire, sorry, inner wire. And we're gonna try not to touch the outer wire with that lead. Then we're gonna take our black one and we're gonna to touch it to the outside. It doesn't matter. You're just testing for continuity. There's no electricity going through these lines. You're not gonna hurt. I'm so. balancing it to do this one-handed and film. So we're gonna to touch. I did get it. <sighs> now all you can all you gotta do is touch it to the two pieces. All right, so no continuity there. That's so not I went the one. through a couple and found the one. I'm gonna show you what it looks and sounds like. So one of your leads on the outside wire. One of your leads on the inside wire, we've got continuity, and there it is. That's the one that goes to the bedroom outlet that we just found. So that's how you do it. Of course, the last step is to label your wires so that you know where they go. So when you're trying to hook stuff up, you got it all taken care of. Thanks for watching this video.